My name is Bob Dean, and uh, I'm based out of the Sacramento area. And I'm involved uh, with a uh, golf country club and have been on the board of directors for almost 20 years uh, and retired off last, or just this year. <laughs> that they uh, wanted to uh, run a fiber optics line through our, through our acreage to get over into the tower and expand their capabilities. And they needed some additional ground space um, for that expansion. And that's when we scratched our head and they, they felt like candidly that they had the rights under the current lease to do all of that without increasing the fee. And that's when I got introduced and we got introduced to, to uh, Vertical Consultants and Hugh. And they uh, uh, said, no, no, let's take a look at that lease. And sure enough, it wasn't really spelled out clearly that they had that right. Matter of fact, it, it, it was the opposite. In other words, if there was expansion or, or needed capabilities on their part, then we had a right to negotiate uh, additional uh, revenues. We were able to gain some significant increase in the revenues as they did their fiber optics and agreed to let them do their fiber optics expansion and, and their, their space on the ground what they felt was the market. Um, they were paying us a thousand dollars more per month than what was, what was the market. And so um, they were always trying to reduce that and offering longer term leases and everything else. And we, we, we based on the fact though, that our one negative of our lease, like any other, I think tower is that they could leave on 30 days notice. And so that's always hanging out there. Um, so our guarantee of rent was never longer than a you know, a, a night, excuse me, a 90 day notice. So uh, when this opportunity came along that uh, they were really desirous to uh, possibly reduce their liabilities, if you will. Um, and the only way they could figure out to do it was to offer us a lump sum payment uh, for a longer term lease. And so we got a third party company with Hughes guidance um, uh, to come in and make an offer because now Octagon had the first right of refusal on the lease if somebody wanted to do that and so sure enough it made them step up to the plate and it became a fairly simple uh amendment to the lease and they went out we went out to a longer term but then they they wrote us a a large a large check um we considered it a very large check um which then guaranteed us our income for literally plus 20 years um as we figured the the, the payoff if you will so now we have no threat that they will be leaving and we will be losing any revenue income because we've got all the revenue technically in the bank. It's an easy one. The answer is, is absolutely seek a, uh, uh, seek a consultant. I mean, here we are, um, you know, a, uh, all of us are not versed on, uh, on our board of directors. We're versed on cell towers and knowledge thereof or the market conditions or where things were changing technology wise or whatever. So, um, we, we, we sought a consultant. My recommendation would be find some consultant though. Don't try and do this on your own as a property owner because of the value that they bring is more than whatever that, that, that little fee would cost you as, a, as an owner or a property owner of, uh, and, and a landlord to a tower. Absolutely, I'd recommend vertical consultants. I, I sincerely would, and if, uh, and I'm not saying that simply because here I am on this this this, this call with with you. I'm saying it because that's exactly the way we feel, felt all along. Um, because one of the other things, not just if there was an issue that came up and we needed to talk about it, um, you know, Hugh was always there, and, and his uh, you know his dollar meter wasn't running when we would ask him what about this and what about that and what's your advice here and what, what do we do so he's really you know earned just a couple of paydays but in between he's serviced us uh, because of the ongoing relationship that we have um, and I say serviced us because it would just be consultation and at no cost so uh, he, he was a true advisor uh, and you know I, I honestly felt and so did our board of directors that he had our best interest at, at his heart um, and always looked out for our best interest um, for us.